Yo, what is going on guys? It is Evil Batman here, back with another Call of Duty Ghost best class setup. And in today's video, we're going to be covering the submachine gun, the CBJMS, which actually got a recent buff. So having said that, let's get right into this class setup. Alright, so obviously for the class setup, we're going to be using the submachine gun, the CBJMS. And as I did mention, it did get a recent buff, making this gun a very powerful submachine gun at very close range. And you'll be easily... Be getting double kills and possibly even triple kills here and there but uh, as you can see I just mow down these kids really fast with this gun and uh, that is partly because of the attachments I'll be using so let's get right into the attachments so I'm gonna be using the muzzle brake and the grip now the muzzle brake is gonna increase the damage at a certain amount of range which is definitely gonna help me get those long range kills now for grip it's this gun has a lot of recoil and grip is going to help me reduce that recoil and pick those guys off at a farther range with the help of the muzzle brake. So I'm not going to be using a secondary, a lethal or a tactical in this case. But as far as the class setup goes, I'm going to be using agility. I want to run around farther, especially the submachine gun. You want to get to places much farther and I don't camp in Call of Duty Ghost. I like to run around. So uh, that and marathon are going to be both used on my class. Also steady aim for some machine guns, you're going to be wanting to use steady aim, especially the CBJMS, which is more of a close range SMG. It doesn't shoot as far, but steady aim will definitely help when you get in close range gunfights. Now for focus, obviously, if you want to win gunfights in Call of Duty Ghosts, as I said in a previous video, the best perk to win gunfights is going to be focus. So if, even if a guy shoots at me first, I can still end up getting the kill like you'll see in some of the clips in this video, all because of focus. Now I'm going to be using fully loaded because this gun has next to no ammo starting off with. So fully loaded will help you get more ammo as well as you're going to start off with more ammo, which will make you stay a little bit longer alive during your streaks. And last one, I'm going to be using gambler. I didn't know what to choose for this last one, so I chose gambler. Gambler will sometimes give you a good perk or sometimes give you a bad perk. In this case, it gave me mostly good perks, so it's definitely something you're going to want to use. Now as far as the strike package goes, I'm using the SATCOM, the Ballistic Vest, and the Oracle. Uh, SATCOM, I'm going to be seeing people. Ballistic Vest, I'm going to need more health, especially with the submachine gun when I am rushing around, trying to pick up kills in the spawn and stuff like that. And Oracle, so I can see them wherever they are, through walls. It's just one of the best support perks in the game. But having said that, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's Call of Duty Ghost best class setup. This was for the CBJMS. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to slap a like and subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. Also, check out the last one. It'll be a link in the description below. This is Beatable Batman, and until next time, I'm out. Peace.